putting on 162 for the third wicket. Then in the final ball of the session, incredible controversy. Owen Morgan thought he'd scored four here after some clumsy fielding by Pravan Kumar. And the batsman began walking off the tee. Replay showed, though, the ball never actually touched the rope. So when the bales came off with Morgan and Bell on their way back to the pavilion, India appealed, perhaps unsportingly, for the unlikeliest run-out you will ever see. And the letter of the law said Bell had to go. A dramatic and savoury end, it seemed, to a brilliant innings of 137. Bell bemused, the crowd furious, with England 254 for four. Where the second session had ended in booze and acrimony, and the England batsman walked back onto the field after tea. It was to astonish stares and then huge cheers to see Ian Bell amongst them. During the interval, Indian captain MS Dhoni had sportingly withdrawn their successful appeal over Bell's controversial run-out. A big call in every sense, the spirit of the game prevailing over the letter of the law. But England were determined to make their own headlines with their batting. Owen Morgan bringing up his half-century in stunning.